for too long. We regular residents, I'm just a regular resident, 35 years plus, Waianae Valley Homestead. Many times we have said, we believe there is dumping. We believe there is illegal grading. We suspect it's private property. What are we to do? Stop the trucks? Check what's on the trucks? What are we to do? Trespass onto private property? If we're just a regular citizen and we don't know the process, but we expect the process to work. So when we raise the flag and we actually find a specific occurrence to where the process is not working, we have expectations that changes will be made to the process to prevent subsequent City recurrences. Turn people in. A lot of our landlords there don't live in the area. They rent it out to other land uh, to other farmers, so-called farmers, who end up dumping, um, using it as dump sites. Period. We turn it into um, the proper authorities. They come out. They give them a fine. Two months later, they end up doing the same thing again. We called in. Our names were very popular, especially Alice Greenwood. Many times the city um, messages would be full with my name, complaining about all the activities that's been happening in our area, and it continues and continues till today. I hear all about these organizations and everything. Where were they? As, as farmers in our area, we never heard of them. Another thing is, look, they're changing Ag 1 to Ag 2 for meeting place for a church. I can't believe that here we're trying to protect the honest farmers and yet all this corruption is happening. How do we stop them? We have laws and yet the laws is not enough. And that's my concern about this whole thing. I do support. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mrs. Greenwood.